Man, okay, full transparency, guys. I literally shot, edited, and reproduced this vlog number one, if you will, probably like four times now, and I'm just like not happy with any of the cuts, any of the takes, and I don't know why it's so hard for me to start vlogging again, but I wanna do this right. And so many different things have been happening, and in order for all of it to make sense, I feel like we really, really just have to start over and I have to bring you into the loop of what's happening in 2021 because I just saw this comment and it literally, our, our boy over here was literally like, yo, I've been waiting for this since 2018. And I'm pretty sure if you've been sticking around for the longest time, you, that's that's probably where you're at too, and I want to make sure we're all on the same page. So in order to do this right, I gotta just start talking about things that have been happening here. So, for starters, Nadia is no longer my girlfriend. There's the bay. She's over there. We're not boyfriend girlfriend anymore. Oh! I have my own space now. I'm not sharing space with a like, roommate or anything like this. Look, I mean, look. There's like this whole. There's a new space now. Do you want to see like a house room tour or whatever? I'm a roommate. They don't know that yet. Oh no, my God. <laughs> for everyone asking about what I do for a living, I still do online coaching. And it's so crazy because in 2016, online coaching looked like this. Spreadsheet, boom, boom. Here's like the sets. Here's like the workout list. And it's like, I really tried to thoroughly explain everything on a piece of paper. And today in 2021, there's a full blown app and online coaching looks like this. Everything is all right here. Boom. The workout for today, right there. It's a follow along video. You can just start and then following up with that. We never stretched before, but now there's post-workout stretches. I can do that in there and you don't you don't have to second guess it. Just hit start. This syncs with your Apple Watch or any other fitness tracker. Right, there I am leading you through the way. Like <laughs> quit that. Boom. And uh, here you can track your macros. You can record anything like so. You can even make up your own meals. There it is. This is the new gold standard. If you have a fitness tracker like the Apple Watch or Fitbit, whatever you want, all of this syncs together and whatever is on your watch gets recorded right here too. On top of online coaching, I've been getting into acting and you may or may not have seen some of my works, but that has been going pretty good lately. Like, yo, yo, what's good everybody? I'm going into my closet now. I'm gonna be doing some ADR. It's a fancy term of basically redoing the audio that's in the movie. In layman's term, it means I messed up during the scene and my audio didn't get picked up clearly or maybe the sound guy messed up, I don't know. Something went wrong, but my voice is bad. So now I gotta watch myself in the scene and actually do my voice as I intended. So normally you go into a studio to do this, but because of COVID times, we're here. Test, test, one, two, one, two. I've also picked up some new hobbies outside of working out. There you go. You can change the tempo like that. <laughs> oh! Oh, oh my! Hey! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> And for the longest time, I know a lot of you have been asking for an SRY, like apparel line, or like the next keep the fam clothes thing. And I know if I wanted to do apparel, I didn't want it to just be me printing like on a piece of cloth. Like I want the material to be really nice. I want this to be like a piece, a staple that's in your closet. It's your go-to thing that you grab and you know that when you put it on, you're gonna look good and in turn, you're gonna feel good. And with that, you're gonna just do good. So. I want to share that with you as well. This like genuinely stinks. There's a reason I was about to wash this and put it in the hamper, but I guess it's a good idea. Oh my God. Okay. So to give you a fuller view, here we go. Excuse the wrinkles. This is dirty in the hamper. I sacrificed myself. Where, where is the lighting on this thing? But all in all, I know starting up the vlogs has been like a really hard thing to do and my friends, my family, everyone around me has just been pushing for me to do it. They want to see more vlogs. I want to do it too and I, I honestly don't know 
why it has been so hard for me to pick it up, but I think one of the things that really got to me was just the idea of perfectionism, if you will. So, like, when I like pick up a camera and point it at a scene now, I literally think like, wow, this scene is not properly white balanced. The audio is gonna bounce off all the walls everywhere. It's, it's just not gonna be good. And with that being said, I just got so caught up in camera equipment, gear, and all the above, and that just stopped the vlogs altogether. And when I really sat down and thought about it, it wasn't the moments where it was a picture perfect camera movie scene that like got you guys. It was the story, the journey, and the experience. And that's what I wanna be sharing with you moving forward. So I'm really excited to bring the vlogs back. Come back. Let's do this.